thank you for that secret, God, for doing the will of you, God. That he went on the cross and he died for our sins, God, that we may come before your throne, God, with our prayers and with our supplications, God. That we may come boldly, God, knowing that he is interceding on our behalf, God. So, Lord, we just thank you right now for this day. For this is the day that you have made, God. It's a beautiful day, God. Lord, the last Sunday of 2020, God. Lord, we thank you, God, for the preached word on this Sunday, God. Because somebody didn't know, God, about that secret, God. Lord, somebody was preparing to go into 2021 without knowing what the secret is, God. So, Lord, we thank you that the word was preached, that the secret is out. Lord, we thank you because, Lord, a lot of people are, a lot of people are preaching this morning, God, about going into 2021, God, but, Lord, we haven't got there yet, God. For it will be a shame for us, God, to, Lord, almost make it into 2021, God, and, and know that the secret has been out the bag for so long, God, and, and Lord, they have not received the secret, God. So we just thank you right now, God, for those who have heard this word, God, letting them know, God, that the secret is out the bag, God. And Lord, that we're not so selfish as just to say that just, just this word, God, but but pastors and preachers all over the world, God, that are preaching that 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 that, that, that the secret is out the bag. Lord, bless them even right now, God. Lord, for someone was prepared to go into 2021 the same way they be leaving 2020, God. But God wants us to know that the secret is out the bag. You don't have to go into 2021 the way you leave in 2020, God. Because the secret is out the bag, God. Lord, somebody didn't know you as your personal Savior, God. But because, Lord, the secret is out the bag, they know that the, that the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life, God. Lord, the secret is out the bag, God. No, you don't have to live like you lived in 2020. You can live a great life in 2021, but you have to accept the secret, God. The secret is out the bag, God. And Lord, we thank you, God. Lord, we thank you, Lord, as for all of those, God, who was on, who's on our sick and shut in list, God, that you would touch each and every one, God. Lord, name by name, God. And Lord, somebody's wondering, God, that 2020 has been an awful year. 2020 was the worst year that we have ever had. But I'm here to tell you that if you don't if you don't receive the secret, Lord Jesus. if you don't receive Jesus the Christ Lord, as your personal Savior, yeah. Thank you, God. the 2021 can be Lord just Jesus. like 2020. All right. All right. All right. But we have Lord a Jesus. blessed assurance, y'all. Yeah. Oh, we have we have hope yes. in the midst oh. of sorrow, oh, y'all. Yeah. Yeah. While the world trying to figure yeah. out what's oh, going to happen in 2021, God, God, we already God. know that God, God. has 2021 yeah. in the palm of his hand. Yeah. God, we know that the word yeah. tells us that the steps of a good man yeah. are more than God alone. So, Lord, we already know that when we yeah. step out of 2020 yeah. and we step yeah. into 2021 yeah. on the same yeah. grace and the same mercy, yeah. on the same Lord and the same God, yeah. and carrying us through 2020 yeah. will carry us in. 
Mr. Meads. Mm -hmm. I'm going to ask, if you will, as our scholarship chairperson, if you will come and uh, thank everyone and then bless this offering. Amen. I'd like to give honor to our Savior, Jesus the Christ, Amen. for Amen. this opportunity yes, to do this. And it's a wonderful opportunity to bless our students to be able to continue their education. So thank all of you for saving. And this basket looks mighty full. So God is good. We might be able to provide. Amen. Amen. He makes a way. Yes. Let us bless this offering. Most holy and all wise Father, we'd like to take this opportunity, Jesus, just to say thank you, Lord, yes, Lord. for making a way out of no way, Father yes. God. Yes. For yes. providing, Father God. Yes. We just give you honor, we Jesus. give you glory, and we give you praise, Lord God. Thank for those who even made sacrifices that maybe they didn't even have, Lord God, but they gave what they had. We thank you, Jesus, because we know that in the end, you will bless us. You will bless us with blessings that we just don't even know where to put them. And we just give your name honor. We give you glory, and we give you praise. Thank you, Lord, for this blessed day. Thank you for this year. Thank we you love God. you and praise your name. Thank you, Lord. Jesus, I pray. Jesus. Amen. 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 We bless God for, for just being God. Mm -hmm. And we thank him for everything that, that he has done. For the word says that every good and perfect gift mm. comes down. Mm -hmm. We do have birthdays and anniversaries for the week of December 27, 2020 to through January the 2nd, 2021. Um, looks like there's no one on that list, but if there are, please make sure you submit the name and the dates to us the next time. December is the last month of the year. Father, in December of this year, crown all my effort with glorious success. Father, let me labor like an elephant and eat too like an elephant. Amen. There are lots of people who labor like an elephant and eat like an ant. Uh -oh. Father, rewrite my destiny, O oh Lord. You can view our recorded services on our YouTube channel, IMMBC Worship Channel. You can give electronically through our cash app, dollar sign IMMBC. Please make sure you add your name and the ministry you are giving to. Tithes, general offering, building fund, 12 tribes, children's, Chinese auction, and fish fry. We do have on our prayer list today, Mother Annie Lincoln family, Sister Marie Johnson, Brother James Pegues, Sister Betty Orr, Brenda Phillips and family, the Lockhart family, Barbara Ford, Trina Smith's mother, Bon Domingo, the Gay family, Sister Marie Frazier, Reverend Larry and Daisy Granberry, Sister Linda Rayford, the Ned Fowler family, Brother Reggie Smith, Sister Dorothy P. Love, Mr. Thomas Quicken family, Sister Ruby Black, James Harrison family, Sister Calandra Fortson, Sister Cinderella Dooley, the Sister Carolyn McKenzie, the Thomas and Clark family, Sister Carolyn Graham, Sister Carol Jones, Brother Tony Mentor, Martin family, Tony Thompson, and the Nichols family. All members who are working away and absent from our service, all the sick, shut in, bereaved, and all the members of the armed forces. Our weekly prayer. We pray for healing, prepare us for surprises, for strength, Prepare us for surprises, for vision. Prepare us for surprises. 
for transformation. Yes. Prepare us mm. for surprises, yes. Yes. for messengers mm. and messages. Thank you, Jesus. Prepare us yes. for surprises, yes. for community. Mm. Prepare us for surprises, yes. for acceptance oh, thank you, Jesus. of ourselves yes. and others. Prepare us for surprises. Jesus. For making room at our tables. Jesus. Hallelujah, God. Prepare us for surprises. Thank you, Jesus. For truth seeking. Thank you, God. Oh, yes. Prepare us for surprises. Yes, yes. For support. Jesus, thank you, Jesus. Prepare us for surprises. Hallelujah. For common ground. Jesus. Prepare us for surprises. Yes. Walk beside us, O Holy One, as we question and welcome, as we challenge and invite, as we discover and understand.
are going to bring our coins. This is symbolic of make change for Christ. Every December, we bring our coins. Uh, we originally started using it as a building fund uh, event. And then the Lord gave us a more excellent reason. Our children, our young adults who are uh, graduating from high school, going on to college to make life their lives better. The, those who have a mind, who know that a mind is a terrible thing to waste, they are moving forward, pressing their way to better themselves. And so today we want to give into our college fund uh, scholarship ministry our coins that we've collected. If you don't have coins because we know there is a shortage, we take green back too because it's all going to be possible. <laughs> Amen? Amen. Amen. So uh, for those of you, Miss Mint, if you'll just give us some music. And for those of you that have your uh, donations, if you'll please come and bring them. Uh, we shall, if you're on the grounds and if you want to um, just mask and come on in and walk through and drop your coins, you can do that. Uh, but just come and be a blessing to somebody else today. Amen? Amen. 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 Years went 
Jesus. Yeah. In the New Testament, it starts out with the Gospels. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what we call the Gospels. Yeah. Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. Yeah. <laughs> that ain't the gospel, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> the gospel is the fact that Jesus was yeah. born. Yeah. Jesus lived. Yeah. Jesus died. Yeah. Jesus was buried. Yeah. Jesus was resurrected yeah. on the third day. Yeah. And he sits in heaven on the right hand of God. Yeah. The Father Almighty making intercessions for us. Yeah. The secret is in the gospel that Jesus came and died that we might live. Yeah. The secret is out. No longer do you have to worry about what you're going through. The secret is out. No longer do you have to worry about your hope. In despair, yeah. tell it. Tell despair. The secret is out. Yeah. I have hope. Yeah. Hope built on nothing yeah. less yeah. but Jesus' yeah. love and his righteousness. Yeah. When hell falls to shepherd. 
Skipping down to the 20th verse, and the shepherds returned, glorifying and praising God for all the things they had heard and seen as it was told unto them. The word of God for the people of God. Thanks be to God. Amen. We're going to ask one of our deacons to please come with our morning prayer, after which our choir shall give us ministry and music, and mm. the Lord shall return through this his humble servant to bring forth the word. Amen? Amen. 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 Good morning. Good morning. <clears throat> thank God for letting us rise this morning where we could come to service, dear God. Yes. Dear God, just thank you for everything you've done for us, dear God. Thank you, Jesus. Dear God, because without you, dear God, mm. we wouldn't be here today, dear God. Mm. Dear God, we're going through all these troubles right now, dear God. But dear God, you're the one that can heal us, take care of everything, dear God. We're going to worry, dear God. But we have got to understand that you're going to be there to take that off of us, dear God. We've got to be strong and go through this thing, dear God. This race not run for the fastest, but the one that can do it to the end. And we've got to be the ones that can do it to the end, dear God. To be a sanctuary, God. You yeah. and holy, God. Thank you, God. Oh, prepare us. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Oh, prepare us, Lord. Yes. Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Oh, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Huh. Confirmation. Yes. Everyday prayer. Everyday mm. prayer. Yes. Hallelujah. Expect mm -hmm. the unexpected. Woo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah. Yes, oh, Lord. Lord. To God be the God. glory. Mm. I just love it when God surprises me. <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh, yes. You know, you think it's going yes. one way and he shows up and says, Surprise! <laughs> I just praise God for him being who he mm. is. Mm. We're going to ask um, Brother Nick Clifton if he'll please come to mm. receive our offering. Um, Deacon Smith and his family are out of town, so we'll pray traveling mercies on them mm -hmm. that they enjoy themselves and have a safe trip back. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I thank God that this year God has not shut up heaven on us. Amen. He has continued to bless us bountifully. Amen. And we're about to see the blessings of God follow fresh out. Amen. I am so excited about the surprises that God is bringing our way. Amen. But we start by showing God that we appreciate all, all right. that he's done for us mm -hmm. by giving back to him that that already belongs mm -hmm. to him. And we do it with a cheerful heart. Yes, yes, we yes. do it gladly because we can't be God given, but because he's allowing us to be most like him and give back, we come now to give unto the Lord. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> Good Lord, we come to you as humble we know how, asking you to bless us and keep us, to bless this offering, and bless each and every person that has made it through this year. Yeah. Lord, we ask you to continue to bless us going into 2021, to bless this offering to grow and be a, a light and a beacon yes. for yes. this yes. community, for yes. this church, yes. and yes. <clears throat> to be able to help as many yes. people as we can. Yes. Lord, we ask all these blessings in the Son of Jesus' most holy and precious yes. name. Yes. Amen. 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 The Lord is blessing me.
something. Oh my God. The word says that we are to walk mm -hmm. in the light. Yes. Oh my God. Because he is the light. Yes. Uh -huh. And I thought, how awesome is it that the light comes to get us to take us into the light. Right. Amen. I, Amen. If the light had not come, mm -hmm. we would still be in darkness and yeah. couldn't yeah. find yeah. our way out All of right. the light. All right. All right. Right. So the light came to bring us into the light. You yeah. preaching already. Go ahead. <laughs>
the goodness of Jesus mm -hmm. and all that he has done for us. Yes, Lord. My soul cries out, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for loving us. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for keeping us. Thank you for just being with us. Mm -hmm. May the grace of God, the sweet communion of his Holy Spirit, may it rest, rule, and abide henceforth and forevermore in the name of Jesus with uplifted voices, those who know the secret mm -hmm. sing
Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Micah, still Old Testament, mm -hmm. the fifth chapter in the second verse mm -hmm. says that he would be born in Bethlehem. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Even 800 years before he was born, mm -hmm. the prophets was trying to tell you where he was going to be born. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Didn't tell you that it was going to be in a stable. Didn't tell mm -hmm. But he told you that he would be born in Bethlehem. Mm -hmm. Bethlehem, the smallest of all the nations. But I come to tell you, Emmanuel, despise not small beginnings. Yes, and out right. of small beginnings comes great things right. when the Lord is in charge. Yes, yes, yes. And Hosea, Hosea 1, 800 years before Jesus came, he too was predicting when God told, when God said, I'll call my son out of Egypt. Mm -hmm. You remember when Jesus went to Egypt? Or do you? Let me tell you. <laughs> when Joseph, when Herod was trying to, when Herod was killing all the babies, mm -hmm. let me back up, thank you, Lord. When the wise men went to go find Jesus mm -hmm. and they stopped by the palace and asked Herod, where is he who is born king of the Jews? Yes. For we have seen his star in the east and have come to worship him. Mm. That Herod said, you go find him and bring me word that I might come and worship him. Mm. But I thank God for, for knowing how to handle what he does. Yes. He sent Joseph and Mary and Jesus down to Egypt. Mm. Well, Hosea 18, 800 years earlier said that God would call his son out of Egypt. Mm -hmm. Reverend Nichols, that coming out of Egypt would preach. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> because yeah. all the, before Jesus came, God had called his people out of Egypt. Yeah. Yeah. There's a bondage, something about Egypt and there's a bondage. But yeah. when God, when God called Jesus out of Egypt, that told me right then that we were going to be set free. Yeah. Yeah. So through the writings of the prophets, mm. God has made known yes. what he is doing. Because yes. the, 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 the disciple, the shepherd said, let us go see this thing mm. that the Lord has made known to us. Mm. The, the angels told him about Jesus being born. So then they have to go see it because it is no longer a secret. The secret is out. Mm. You know now what was under the tree. Yeah. You know now. Mm. But see, you don't know what was going to be on the tree. But you ain't got that for you. You're so wrapped up in what's under the tree. You ain't even looking at what's on the tree. But even yeah. in that, God is trying to tell them that there's going to come a day yeah. when what was under the tree does not matter, but it's what I put on the tree that gave you eternal life. And just it tells me that Psalm 22, a thousand years before they crucified him, David cried out, my God, my God. According to my gospel and the preaching of Jesus Christ, according to the revelation of the mystery, which was kept secret, since the world began, but now is made manifest by the scriptures of the prophet mm -hmm. according to the commandment of the everlasting God made known to all nations for the obedience of faith. Mm -hmm. Got something to tell y'all this morning. Mm -hmm. The secret is out. <laughs> the secret is out. Okay. Christ is born. Yeah. Yeah. Christ the Savior is born. Mm. It is amazing how God has connected these messages this month. Uh -huh. Somebody said that you and Reverend Nichols, y'all just really, you know, speaking y'all's Christmas speeches. <laughs> And I told him it's just God connecting all the dots yeah, yeah. so that we might get a full picture of what's going on. Mm -hmm. And then last Sunday when Reverend Nichols was preaching, my disclaimer is I already had my message for the day. Go ahead. Go ahead. So when God confirmed it in his message, I was like, God, I just love the way you put things together. Yeah, yeah. Because he talked last week about the, the I knew he was going to talk about the decorated tree. I just didn't know to what extent. <laughs> but he and God just showed up. Yeah. Yeah. And then he kept talking about the gift mm. that was under the tree. Yeah. And the gifts that were under the tree wasn't, weren't what we need to focus on, but the gift that was on the tree. 
country. Yeah. Well, if you don't mind, I need to take you back to the gifts that are under the tree. All mm -hmm. right. Because right. while the gifts are under the tree, the secret is out. Now you know what they are. Mm -hmm. I, I'm grateful that I got this message after Christmas. All right. Because right. it's out now. The secret is out. So you know what's under the tree. Mm -hmm. But for months, somebody had been keeping it a secret. Yeah. They had been hiding it in the closet, mm -hmm. hiding it under the bed, mm -hmm. taking it over somebody else's house, yeah. putting it in the car, in the trunk of the car, hiding it on the clothes, trying to keep the secret from getting out. Uh -huh. But if you listen closely, they were giving you hints all the time. They were <laughs> dropping little words that might give you some clue, but you weren't focused on that, so you didn't hear that. Mm. When I got to this scripture, and it said that now unto him mm. who has the power to establish you, mm. not establish, but to establish well, you, all right. to make you strong, to make you firm, to, 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 to put you where you need to be, mm. not to recreate you, but to put you where you need to be, to bring you into being. The same God according to the gospel and the preaching of Christ, according to the revelation of the mystery, which was kept secret since the world began. All right. Now God, God wasn't really keeping it secret, well, but he was keeping how he was going to do things well, a secret. Because right. you can't tell everybody right. everything. Right. You can't put your business out there because yeah, somebody, yeah. if they know your plan, they'll upset the plan and, and make it go another way. Right. But you give them just enough to get them interested, you know, kind of whet their appetite a little bit. <laughs> well, God, through the prophets, were predicting the birth of Jesus. I can take you all the way back to Genesis mm. <laughs> when God himself spoke. Mm. In Genesis 3, it says that. Uh, the woman that he shall the, the seed of the woman shall crush your head. Devil, uh -huh. God was telling you in the garden of Eve mm -hmm. that your head is going to be crushed by the seed of a woman. Wow. Uh -huh. Was not Jesus born of a woman? Yes, yes. Alright. <laughs> Rips my case. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I was like, God, then he told me that even in 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 in, uh, in 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 Genesis 12, 3, when he told Abraham right. that the whole world would be blessed mm. through you. Well, yes, he did. In Abraham, Abraham, Isaac, mm. Jacob, Jacob had 12 sons. Mm -hmm. The fourth son was named Judah. Jesus came through the lineage of Judah. Mm -hmm. Did not Jesus bless the whole world? Yeah. Did not God bless the whole world when yeah. John 3.16 says, For God, you no longer have to put up with that. The devil is already defeated. He acts like he doesn't know, but I promise you, he knows he's defeated. But as long as he can keep you thinking that he has won, that he is winning, then you won't give yourself over. And I promise you, it's a fixed fight. The game is already over. The buzzer has already sounded. And on this side, the whole team has already won the victory. Woo! If you, right where you are, if you're still hidden, in sin. The secret is you can come out of it right now by accepting Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior. Whatever you're going through, God does not intend for you to go through it by yourself. He's right here to go through it with you, to bring you out of it, to bring you on the other side. Won't you give your life to Him today? This last Sunday in the month of December, this last Sunday in the month, in the year of 2020. Maybe you've had a rough year, but, but come out of it, nail it, by giving your life to Christ. Wherever you are, 
whatever, wherever you are, in your, in your car, in your home, wherever you are, your truck, your van, in the yard, it doesn't matter, wherever you are, come now to Christ. Come and allow him to show you the secrets that he has for you. He has an awesome surprise for you. He has a place prepared just for you. And one day he's coming back to receive you for himself, unto himself. Won't you give yourself to him today? We thank God for keeping it under wrap. But when Mary unwrapped the swaddling clothes off of the baby, when the gift was unwrapped, you and I began to be able to receive the benefits of the gift. When the gift was unwrapped, coming out of the tomb, we began to receive the benefits of salvation through the obedience of faith. Won't you be obedient to the faith today and receive Christ? Whether you strayed away and you need to be reclaimed, reconnected to Christ, he's here to do that. Receive him now. Right where you are. Reverend Nicholas is going to come and take us to the throne of grace and prayer. And as we have pre-assembled here knowing that when we come back, we'll be in a new year. I'm going to ask him to just allow the Lord to use him however God sees fit. And help us to focus on the upcoming year with positive energy, with, with a spiritual outlook. Knowing that God is able to do exceeding and abundantly above all that we may ask or think according to the power that works in us. We had a comfort world to be with you, God. dear God. You, that's God. something that they can't take away from us, dear Jesus. God. Whatever they do, that's going to be with us always. Mm -hmm. You brought us, and we can be a light to someone else out here in this world, Thank dear you, God. Because you sent Jesus to light for us, dear God. Yes. So we got yes. to return the faith. We could help Thank people that's in need, dear God. Thank you, we look at the people out there in the tents, dear mm, God. Lord. Dear God, I feel so sorry oh, for them, dear yes, God. Yes. But I do everything and I pray, oh, God, that you Jesus. help them, dear God. Mm. 
Because we can help. And if I let the pain that bring, I will bring it, get it, and I get it done for dear God. Because you blessed me to have what I have right now. And I thank God for you blessing me. But I want to share that with other people also, dear God. Because you give it to me, and I want to give it to someone else. Dear God, this is my prayer in your name. Amen. 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 I ain't quiet.
God. We magnify you. We thank you for this last Sunday. This beautiful day that you have given us, God. And to let the world know. Thank you, Jesus. 2021 is right. Jesus. The secret is out now. Yes, yeah. yes. The secret's been out. Oh, yes. Somebody might not make it to 2021. Lord have mercy. That's right. But if you receive the gift, right. which is Jesus Christ. Yes. If you receive that surprise. Yes, yes. That, that, Lord that Jesus. the prophets been prophesying about. Yes. And the yes. preachers are preaching about. Yes. If you receive yes. that secret, which is Jesus yes. Christ. Yes. Then as you enter into 2021, God. or God. even as you enter into tomorrow, yes. Yes. you have the blessed assurance to know yes. that if you leave this place Lord Jesus. to be absent from Lord the body, Jesus. it's to be present oh, with the Lord. Thank, yeah. you God. Thank you, God. Don't look for 2021. Thank you, God. That's right. Mm. Let's get it done today. Yes, Jesus. Wow. For the secret is at the We thank you for this thank preacher, God. Thank we thank you, you for this pastor who has come and delivered this word, God. Thank we thank you, God, for the 12 months, God, that you have been using her, God. That she's been standing on the wall preaching your word, God. And Lord, that she, Lord, as she came in in 2020, God, the last Sunday of 2020, God. Lord, she ain't lost the fire, God. Yeah. That the word is still going forth with power. The word is still going forth with the authority, God. So, Lord, bless her even right now, God. As you prepare now for 2021, God. It's going to get done in 2021. Lord, we thank you, Lord, for all of us, God. We thank you, Lord, for every, Lord, member of this, of this body, God. We thank you, Lord, that, Lord, even when, even when we was up against the odds, God, that, Lord, your words still went Glad forth, God. God. We Glad thank you for the, for the choir, God. Yes. How they still, oh, yes. Lord, ever since the pandemic, God, yes. they still was faithful enough yes. to come out and sing your praises, you, God. Jesus. Lord, we thank you, Lord, for all the, you, all the, um, all of the officers, God, yes. of Emmanuel Memorial yes. Missionary yes. Baptist yes. Church, God. Yes. How they didn't say we're going to wait for the Thank pandemic to be God. over Thank to resume God. our responsibilities. Lord but, Lord, how they just, Lord, just went on yes. Sunday after Thank Sunday, you. God. Lord, we thank you, God. Thank Lord, we ask right now, God, that even Thank if, Lord, we can, we can feel the spirit inside the house, God, with just a couple of, of, of few, a few people, God. We thank you, Lord, that, Lord, every Sunday, God, that our grounds, Lord, those that are in their cars, God, Lord, we thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness, God. How, Lord, they can, how, Lord, they can say, you know what? I've been praising you all year long, God. Lord, and I'm not going to stop now, God. If I'm able to get up, God, if I'm able to get in my vehicle and just go to the grounds, God. Lord, it just reminds me of the woman with the issue of blood, God. She said, if I can just get to Jesus. She said, I know it's a crowd. I know it's stuff that's hindering me from getting to Jesus. But if I can just touch the healing of God, if I can just get to him, God. And I feel like that's how the parking lot folks are. They say, if I can just get to the ground, God. If I can just get to the ground, God. I can just feel the connection. If I can just get to the ground, God. we thank you, God, for it. Over these nine months, Thank God, how they have been out, God, yes. in the parking lot yes. receiving the word, yes. God. Thank and, Lord, we thank you, God, for those, Lord, who stayed at home, God. Lord, bless we even God. bless them, God, because, bless Lord, 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 I, Lord, I share the ministry, bless God. I share bless the service, God. So I see they not just in their beds, God. Lord I see, Jesus. Lord, that they are, Lord, they online, yes. Lord, and they're watching the word, God. Yes. Lord, they online. When they say preach, preacher. When they say amen, God. So, Lord, we just thank you, God. That, Lord, even though they might not be on the premises, God, they still connected to the body, God. So, Lord, we are just thank you. We thank you for 2020, God. Because you have proved to us that you are still God. You have proved to us, God, that there's nothing too hard for you, God. We thank you, God, where the world say, oh, I can't wait to get out of 2020. God, we say thank you for 2020, God. Yes, we love the faith along the way, but to be absent from the body, God, is to be present with you, God. Yes, we love the family and the sick kids, God. Yes, we had some heartaches and pains this year, God. 
when they left the shepherds, the shepherds went to go see. And then the shepherds came back telling everybody that they saw. Y'all, the secret is out. The Savior is born. Y'all, no more do we have to worry about being oppressed. No more do we have to worry about being depressed. No more do we have to worry about not having enough because God's going to supply all our needs. No more do we have to worry about does anybody love me? Because Paul says, what can separate us from the love of God? I am persuaded that neither life, death, nor angels, nor principalities, nor powers, nor things present, nor things yet to come, neither height nor depth, oh, hey, nothing will separate us from the love of God. So even when I don't feel love, I know my yeah. Jesus is yeah. The secret is out, y'all. Yeah. And it says that they went and told everybody. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey, hey, hey. They went and told everybody. That's why it says in Romans 1, 16, I'm not ashamed of the gospel. Because yeah. yeah. it's the power of God yeah. unto salvation. Yeah. I'm not ashamed to let everybody know that I have received Jesus Christ as my Lord and Savior. Because one day I come to tell you that the secret is going to be out. Yeah. All you thinking that there is no heaven and there's no hell, one day the secret is going to be out. Yeah. And it's going to be revealed when Jesus comes and cracks the sky and he steps out and calls those that are dead in Christ and those that are alive shall be called to meet him. Yeah. Yeah.
Uh, but I know how how fickle men can be sometimes. Not talking about man, man. Mm -hmm. No, no, <laughs> man, yeah. mankind. Get it right. <laughs> he said, I know how they can be sometimes. So what if they forget? And Jesus said, Well, mm -hmm. so the angels say, Well, do you have another plan? You got you have a plan B, because that one might not work. And Jesus said, No, I don't have another plan. I'm counting on them to do what I've asked them to do. God is telling us today, I'm counting on you yeah. to do what I yeah. asked you to do. Yeah. I have saved you. Yeah. I healed you. Yeah. I delivered you. I made yeah. a way out of no way. I yeah. came when nobody else would come to you. I called your name. Yeah. Your name. When everybody else was calling you that name but a child of God. Yeah. 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 
Oh, come, let us exalt him. Amen. For only he is worthy. Mm -hmm. If you're still going through whatever you're going through, mm -hmm. and you think that you have to go through it, mm -hmm. I come this morning to tell you that the secret mm -hmm. is out. Mm -hmm. 